Welcome back to the Zoom Chemistry Hub. Today with an another interesting video in which we will discuss and learn the most important and exam oriented MCQs for all board and competitive exam. So let's start. First question the ozone is present in option a mesosphere option b thermosphere option c stratosphere and the option d is troposphere and the correct option is the option c because ozone is present in the stratosphere which is the second most layer of the atmosphere question number two all are air pollutants except option a no2 option b n2 option c so2 and option d is so3 answer is option b because nitrogen is only the gas which is inert in nature because it is also present in our atmosphere uh, in a very high amount or a very high percentage so it is an it is an inert gas so the option b is correct next question Question number three, which one of the following is responsible for global warming? Option A, increase in concentration of N2. Option B, increase in concentration of CO2. Option C, increase in concentration of O2. And option D, increase in concentration of H2O and the correct option is because global warming is due to the increase in concentration of carbon dioxide in our atmosphere so the option b is correct question number four the ph of acid ran is less than option a 13.6 option b 10.6 option c 7.6 and option d is 5.6 and the correct answer is option d the ph of acid ran is less than 5.6 so the option D is correct next question question number 5 the coldest region in the atmosphere is as we know that our atmosphere consists of four layers or regions that is troposphere option A stratosphere option B uh, mesosphere option C and the thermosphere option D so the coldest region in the atmosphere is option C mesosphere here the temperature is about minus 92 degrees centigrade so the option C is correct next question question number six ozone is formed in the presence of ultraviolet radiation from option a both the atomic oxygen are combined option b molecular oxygen o2 and atomic oxygen are combined option c molecular oxygen O2 and another molecule oxygen O2 are combined and option D is O2 and O3 are combined and the correct answer is option 
B. Because for the formation of ozone, O2 and atomic oxygen combine and they form the O3 molecule that is ozone. Next question, question number 7. The gases which are responsible for acid rain. Option A. Sulfur dioxide. Option B. Nitrogen dioxide. Option C. Carbon dioxide. And option D is all. That is sulfur dioxide, nitrogen dioxide and carbon dioxide. And the correct option is option D. Because all the three gases form the acid. That is sulfur dioxide produce H2SO4. Similarly, nitrogen dioxide produce nitric acid HNO3 and carbon dioxide produce carbonic acid H2CO3. So the option D is correct. Next question, question number 8. On the basis of temperature variation, the number of atmospheric region are option A 5, option B 2, option C 3, option D is 4 and the correct option is option D because we have the four region in which the temperature variations occur. Next question, question number 9, the gas which protect the earth surface from the ultraviolet radiations. Option A, CO2 gas, option B, N2 gas, option C, O3, ozone and option D is O2, oxygen gas. And the correct option is option C. That is the ozone gas which is present in the stratosphere which prevent the ultraviolet radiation in the stratosphere and they do not allow the ultraviolet radiation to come on the earth's surface. So the option C is correct. Next question, question number 10. The lowest temperature in the troposphere is option A 5 degree centigrade, option B minus 5 degree centigrade, option C 56 degree centigrade and option D is minus 56 degree centigrade. And the correct option is option D because in the troposphere the lowest temperature is minus 56 and it ranges from 15 to minus 56 that is the range that is the temperature range in the troposphere so the option d is correct minus 56 that's for all today Students, if you like this video, please like, subscribe and share with your friends and fellows so we can grow each other.